Good day, folks. Thank you for joining us here at Your Health. On today's program, we'd like to talk about black seed oil. That's B-L-A-C-K, like the color black. Black seed oil has been called a treatment for all diseases and the most popular herb in the world. It is truly remarkable and worth the time it takes to learn a little bit about it. So please stay tuned to learn about black seed oil. First, let's go to the news and see what's happening in the health world. Two new studies find consuming ultra-processed foods increases the risk of disease and death. First from a study of over 100,000, French researchers find for each 10% increase of highly processed foods in the diet, the risk of cardiovascular disease increases by 12%. The study, a second study of 20,000 from Spain, finds those who consume four servings of ultra-processed foods a day are 62% more likely to die from any cause. These studies were published by the British Medical Journal. Related research from Harvard University finds reducing blood pressure and salt along with trans fat intake would prevent 100 million deaths worldwide over the next 25 years. This study was published by the medical journal Circulation. Well, isn't this amazing? First from the British Medical Journal, we learn those who consume ultra-processed foods such as packaged, prepackaged baked goods and snacks, fizzy drinks, sugary cereals, ready meals with food additives, dehydrated vegetable soups, reconstituted meat and fish products, among many other processed and prepackaged foods. Those who consume these types of foods are at 12% increased risk of cardiovascular disease for every 10% increase of consumed foods. So it's possible for those who eat these foods frequently to be at twice the risk or more of our most common killer, cardiovascular disease. Next, we learn those who consume four servings a day of processed foods are at 62% increased risk of death from any cause when compared with those who eat two servings a day of these low-quality foods. Now, this point helps us to realize our bodies can handle a little, but not a lot, of these ultra-processed foods. And finally, we learn if we take the steps to improve our blood pressure levels, reduce our salt and trans fat intake, it could save some 100 million lives over the next 25 years. And we did it without taking any medication or having a surgery or even visiting a doctor. Now we can do this by eating healthy, fresh, and minimally processed organic foods, staying fit and trim with regular exercise, supplementing our diet with vitamin D, fish oil, and other healthy nutrients. If we do these holistic things, not only could we prevent disease and death, Many more could attain vibrant health, which leads to improved productivity and a better life in general. Now, one last point. No one can do this for you. These changes are up to you. Spending at least two hours a week in nature improves health and quality of life. Researchers from the University of Exeter evaluated over 20,000 subjects. They found those who spend at least 120 minutes a week in nature and we're more likely to also report good health and psychological well-being. The pattern held true for short or long visits to nature, men or women, old or young, and all walks of life. The study was published by Scientific Reports. Related research from the University of Texas at Arlington finds modern urban sprawl in the development of large neighborhoods creates food deserts, where convenience stores and fast food restaurants are the major supplier of foods. The study found more compact traditional neighborhoods are more likely to provide healthy food choices. The study was published by Urban Studies. Modern city living has provided many conveniences and advantages. However, the development of urban sprawl can also deprive us of the regular interaction with nature that does so much for our physical and mental health. Our first study finds spending at least two hours a week at town parks, woodlands, country parks and beaches, among other many other outdoor locations, leads to better physical health and a stronger, more vibrant state of mental health. Another recent study found spending time outdoors provides over 25 distinct health benefits beyond that provided by vitamin D. And the nature-induced health benefits holds true for all walks of life, young and old. Now, this is something that we will never be able to get from a pill or electronic device. It requires the great outdoors and our willingness to take the effort to be there. Just step outside. It's not that hard. We also learn 
that the relatively recent development of urban sprawl with its huge housing developments leads to what researchers called food deserts, where healthy food choices are at least a mile or more away. When it is hard to get to the healthy foods, what do people do? Well, they eat what is easy and convenient. And too often, that's prepackaged and fast foods. And these foods, without any doubt, increase disease and suffering while shortening life. Fortunately, folks, all these problems can be solved. But we must have knowledge before we can have a better life. Well, today on Your Health, we will discuss one of the great superfoods, black seed oil, also known as Nigella sativa. Stay tuned to learn more. time is here again with our annual cancer-free celebration. Cindy and I would like to thank you for your continued support of our efforts here at Your Health Television and at BioInnovations. We understand you must be very careful with your budget, so we're offering you the best prices of the year on many of your favorite supplements for the entire month of May. And shipping is free on all orders over $50 in the continental U.S. Perhaps you've heard about many of these supplements and wondered if they'd help you. Now's a great time to give them a try. Dr. Becker's Bionutrients and Noni Natural Skin Care are up to 50% off. Aloha Noni and Acai are still half price by the case. And many other products you've grown to trust are up to 30% off. May is a great time to stock up on your favorites. Order online at bioinnovations.net or call 888-442-2128 and let us assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. I'm Cindy Becker and this is Your Health at a Glance. Heavy metal poisoning is a growing concern and it may play a role in your health. It can happen through occupational exposure or environmental pollution or both. If you work in a metal shop, a smelting plant or any type of facility that uses electroplating or welding, you may be suffering from heavy metal exposure. But those of us who live in cities may suffer from heavy metal exposure through environmental pollution. It's the number one cause of heavy metal poisoning. It can occur over a long period of exposure or it can happen after a single dose. Symptoms can be overlooked because they're symptoms of common diseases such as fatigue, memory loss, tremor, joint pain, and indigestion. These are common symptoms of heavy metal poisoning. If your health is declining and you haven't been able to figure out the underlying cause, discuss heavy metal poisoning with your doctor. For your health at a glance, I'm Cindy Becker. Is your life out of balance? It may be. The average American consumes far too many omega-6s and not enough omega-3s. This creates an imbalance. So what can we do to get back in balance? We can eat a healthy diet. And most of us need to supplement with omega-3 rich fish oil. Fish oil contains omega-3s with DHA and EPA, fatty acids that promote good brain and heart health. So reduce omega-6 in your nutritional plan and boost omega-3 to get back in balance. To help you do that, BioInnovations offers two products, the Fish Oil Complex and Omega-369, both formulated for your health and well-being. So how do you choose? For highest levels of DHA and EPA, choose the Fish Oil Complex. For a balanced formula, choose the 369. Go online at bioinnovations.net or call 888-442-2128. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. Welcome back everyone. It is such a blessing to be with you today. And today we get to talk about one of our favorite herbs of all time, black seed oil. This one's just amazing. Useful for just about anything topical as a supplement, even for an essential oil carrier oil. Isn't that amazing? So Richard, let's talk about black seed oil and learn yes. everything we can. Yes, Nigella sativa. It goes by many names. We'll call it black seed oil. It's called Kalanji in India. It's called black cumin seed oil in Old English, and in Hebrew, kaziah. But we'll call it black seed oil. It is one of the most me important medicinal herbs for people of the Middle East and Southeast Asia. It has been called one of the most widely used herbs worldwide, and yet here in America, we're just learning about black seed oil. It has been called a treatment for virtually all diseases, and a recent review of all the research on black seed oil 
they tallied up the historical uses and the current scientifically supported uses for black seed oil and the total was some 130 different disease processes can be treated with black seed oil. That truly is almost a treatment for all diseases. Quite remarkable. This remarkable plant is native to Southwest Asia, Syria, Turkey, Saudi Arabia, Pakistan, and India. That's where it grows naturally. And it's been used for many, many centuries. It is truly an ancient herb. Over 3,000 years of use, King Tutankhamun, King Tut, had black seed oil in his tomb with him. Cleopatra used black seed oil as a beauty aid. It is, has its origins in the Yunani and Ayurvedic medical systems. The Yunani system, that word means from Greece. So the type of medical system that the ancient Greeks used spread throughout that part of the world. And, it, and many people still use that as their fundamental medical treatment, and that's called Yunani. Ayurveda is one of the more com it's the most common medical system of India. It's been used there for at least 1,500 years, probably longer. It is cultivated in many places, Southern Europe, Asia, the Middle East, and any climate appropriate worldwide. I, in my research on this topic, I did not see any source in the United States that grows black seed oil. But we have climates appropriate. I'm thinking of Arizona and the arid southwest. I would think it would grow beautifully. Farmers, check into it. This is an amazing substance. It helps a lot of people, and I'm sure you could have a profitable crop and help a lot of people with black seed oil production. It has been uh, named the best all-around herb on the planet. Best, now that's a very bold statement. And that's not hype, it's not my words. This is in the scientific literature today. The best all-around herb on the planet. When we take a look at this beautiful plant, we see it has elegant white to yellow, pink to light blue, uh, petals on the flower, and it really is a beautiful plant. Uh, even to lavender, this multicolored flower is really quite gorgeous. Five to ten petals is typical. It is in the buttercup family of flowering plants. The fruit is the medicinal agent. We call it the seed, but the botanist reminds us that it's actually the fruit. That is a technicality, but We'll still call it the seed because it certainly looks like a seed, doesn't it, Cindy? It looks like a seed to me, but the botanist wants you to know it's actually the fruit. Now, the crushed seed powder is also medicinal, but the highly prized agent of black seed is the oil from black seed. The oil of the seed is aromatic with a slightly bitter taste, but it is palatable. You can put it in your mouth and swallow it and not be disgusted. It's not bad at all. In fact, it's used as a seasoning and a spice for many Middle Eastern dishes. They incorporate it into their diet. It's such a good medicinal agent. It has a complex chemical composition, over 100 different compounds. The seed powder. So you take the seed, you crush it, crush out the oil, and a powder remains. The powder is used more as a food. The oil is used more as a medicinal agent. But there are some 100 different compounds, protein in the seed powder, oils, fiber, minerals, B vitamins, and a wide variety of physiologic active compounds, such as alkaloids, essential fatty acids, saponins, flavonoids, and cardiac glycosides, quite complex molecules. The active ingredients in the oil are thought to be primarily thymoquinone, thymol, and thymohydroquinone. However, I want everyone to understand the magic, the wondrous nature of black seed oil comes from the symphony of agents. When we extract individual agents, we can prove merit with those individual agents. And the pharmaceutical companies, this is their method. They extract one of those compounds. Yes, it does a certain thing. Well, let's change the molecule a little bit so we can patent that agent and call it a drug. They promote this notion that if there's an individual agent, but really what makes all of these natural agents so special is the symphony of molecules that help assist and create a synergistic improvement in your health condition. 
So let's not be too eager to break it into its pieces. But I want you to know the scientists have thoroughly studied it and have identified over 100 different compounds. I just want to name a few. They're interesting. There are a few chemists in the crowd who love to hear these kinds of words. Lemonine. Yes, the same thing you find in lemon. It has a little bit of that. Carvacrol, C p-cymine, alpha-pinene, terpenol, longifolene, anthol, and many other derivatives, polyphenols, you know, these powerful antioxidants that provide health benefits. It's full of those too. Great interest as a pharmaceutical agent, but let's not wait for the drug companies. Use the natural source. Historically, black seed oil has been used for asthma, bronchitis, cancer, rheumatism and a variety of arthritis, anything that causes pain, headache, wide variety of infections, it is a great antibiotic. Dysentery, infectious diarrhea, this type of thing, digestive problems as an appetite stimulant, as a, as a weight loss aid. It can stimulate the appetite and yet it can help you lose weight and that's been proven in a double blind study that it can help you to lose weight. This is what we call modulation of the appetite correcting the appetite. Uh, dysmenorrhea, painful periods, absent periods, uh, parasites, variety of rashes, fatigue, energy, and on and on. Some 130 different health conditions have been treated over the ages with black seed oil. Now as the scientists get involved in investigating usefulness of black seed oil, we find scientifically proven uses, it is a powerful and useful anti-inflammatory. A wonderful analgesic calms pain. It reduces your cholesterol and triglyceride levels. It is a great antibiotic. A really good, it's up there with oil of oregano. Oil of oregano and black seed oil are probably our two best herbal antibiotics. I hate to say I'm perfectly sure of that because we haven't investigated all the herbs in the world yet, have we? But we're working on it. So far, black seed oil and oil of oregano are two of our best natural antibiotics. Anti-cancer agent, it's a powerful antioxidant, an anti-diabetic, anti-hypertensive. It is an immune system modulator. It can improve the immune response or calm it down, like in autoimmune disease where the immune system is hyperactive, we can calm it down. It protects the stomach, the liver, and the brain from damage. It is a great wound healing adjunct. And we have over 700 original studies in the past 50 years, 700 original studies in the past 50 years. And here's an interesting tidbit. There have been over 500 PhD theses awarded the PhD status with the thesis on black seed oil. That fascinating for the science student to get the highest degree awarded in science, a PhD in science, study black seed oil. That's fascinating to me. Well, that's our start. When we return, let's get right into black seed oil's antimicrobial properties. With MRSA and all the super germs that we have today, this is something you need to hear. We'll be right back. Savings Time is here again with our annual cancer-free celebration. Cindy and I would like to thank you for your continued support of our efforts here at Your Health Television and at BioInnovations. We understand you must be very careful with your budget, so we're offering you the best prices of the year on many of your favorite supplements for the entire month of May. And shipping is free on all orders over $50 in the continental U.S. Perhaps you've heard about many of these supplements and wondered if they'd help you. Now's a great time to give them a try. Dr. Becker's Bionutrients and Noni Natural Skin Care are up to 50% off. Aloha Noni and Acai are still half priced by the case. And many other products you've grown to trust are up to 30% off. May is a great time to stock up on your favorites. Order online at bioinnovations.net or call 888-442-2128 and let us assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. I'm Cindy Becker for Your Health at a Glance. We all have said, I need to get some exercise, but how many of us put on our walking shoes and go? Learning a little more about the health benefits of exercise may help you get motivated to lace up those walking shoes. 
Exercise helps to control our appetite and weight. It maintains strong muscles. It promotes the release of endorphins that counter depression while helping us feel good about our lives. Exercise helps to lower blood glucose, promotes a strong circulatory system, and controls cholesterol. Exercise even helps us get a good night's sleep. Recent research finds dog owners who regularly walk their pet are 34% more likely to achieve fitness goals. You can get all of these health benefits by walking 30 minutes four times a week, just 30 minutes a day. Start today and you'll start to get all those benefits. For your health at a glance, I'm Cindy Becker. CoQ10 and L-carnitine are among the most important nutrients our bodies use for energy production. Deficiency in these key nutrients can cause serious complications to your health. In fact, statin drugs that are used to lower cholesterol may deplete your CoQ10 levels. BioInnovations brings you Dr. Becker's Bionutrients CoQ10 with L-carnitine. Now providing support for cardiovascular health is easier than ever before. CoQ10 and L-carnitine support a healthy heart naturally, as nature intended. And our formulation provides 300% greater absorption of CoQ10 than similar products using a technology so effective it's patented. BioInnovations is the affordable source that you can trust for all your vitamin and supplement needs. Give us a call at 888-442-2128. That's 888-442-2128. Or order online at bioinnovations.net. We're back everyone talking about the remarkable effects of black seed oil. This one is just amazing, isn't it? So Richard, black seed oil has really great antimicrobial properties, it does. right? And it's useful for infections inside and outside. Uh, antiviral, antibacterial, antifungal, antiparasitic, all of it. It's a tremendous antibiotic. It's applicable for many of our most common infections. It's thought that thymoquinone is the principal agent, but again, it's the symphony of agents that make these natural uh, herbs and whatnot so effective in their use and side effect free. A little gentle action from each molecule, it adds up to big action without side effects. That's really the secret to this. Gram positive and gram negative bacteria, this is a wide category of infectious agents. Viruses, parasites, fungi, staphylococcus, even the MRSA, methicillin resistant staph, is sensitive to uh, black seed oil. Streptococcus pyogens, that's your strep throat. Streptococcus pneumonia, the most common cause of community acquired uh, pneumonia, is sensitive to black seed oil. Klebsiella causes pneumonia and urinary tract infections. Proteus. Pseudomonas, a real problem for diabetics. Salmonella. E. coli, Shigella, cholera, even cholera. The Vibrio family of uh, organisms is sensitive to black seed oil. And it's been used for thousands of years for this, folks. This tells us that it, there's no resistance. That's the remarkable thing. Hundreds and hundreds of years of use without the development of resistance. Uh, 30 years of penicillin, we had resistance. Now we're going on 80 years of penicillin use, 80, 90 years of penicillin use. It's not nearly as useful as it used to be, but natural agents like this, still working. What else? Oh, we've all heard of the H. pylori infection of the stomach. It can lead to stomach ulcers. And in some unfortunate souls who chronically harbor this H. pylori, it can lead to cancer of the stomach. Well, they were able to show in a very good study, well-designed study, one to two grams of black seed oil a day equaled the triple prescriptive uh, regimen for H. pylori. That's two antibiotics and an acid-suppressing drug, just black seed oil, a natural agent with no side effects, much cheaper, was equal. Now, you, many of us, we don't trust natural agents quite as much as the medicines, right? Because we're told by the doctor, well, that stuff's not studied. If you watch this program and you do for a length of time, you know that's not a true statement. But it's okay. My point is it's okay to take the black seed oil with the triple treatment for H. pylori. There's no drug interactions here. We'll get to that later on in the program. And don't you think it will increase your chances of really suppressing that uh, H. pylori, because that's a real problem. Many people go through the triple drug treatment for H. pylori, and two months later, they have it again. 
Well, just stay on that black seed oil for a while and really get rid of it. Now you're doing something. You could protect yourself even from cancer. It's a good idea, good idea. What else do we have? Listeria monocytogens. This is a very virulent form of food poisoning. The dermatophytes. I'm talking about fungi that infect the skin. Trichophyte and rubrum, trichophyte and menogryphites, uh, trichophyte and interdigitalis. This is, uh, these are all the germs that cause athlete's foot and fungal toenails. Whoosh, done. And it works better than myconazole. If you go into one of your drug stores today and ask for over-the-counter athlete's foot prep, uh, the doctor or the pharmacist will say, try myconazole. It works for a lot of people. Black seed oil works better. Works better. It also is helpful for invasive fungal pathogens. I'm talking about things like aspergillus, coccidioides, mycosis, this type of thing. A wide variety of fungal strains, including candida, yeast, and moles. It also has antiviral properties. This is truly one of the great banes of human existence is the virus. We don't have drug treatments for it. There are a few drugs for herpes. If you get in within 24 hours of your first symptoms, it might be helpful. But, I'll, you know, who does that? You know, nobody gets in within 24 hours of their first symptoms. So it's really, they, they're not that helpful. But black seed oil is helpful for herpes simplex, cytomegalovirus, and these are related germs. They have very much the same influence. Epstein-Barr virus, et cetera, et cetera. Recently, researchers were able to show that Alzheimer's disease may have its origins in inflammation from a herpetic virus. If we were to take natural agents, perhaps this is speculation. It's not, well, I don't have proof of this, but maybe if we had better natural antibiotics in our diet and supplement plans, maybe we could suppress these viruses a little better and be less susceptible to these horrible chronic complications from viral infections. Wouldn't that be nice? Maybe taken orally or topically or both. You can do both. And here's the thing. Common supplemental doses are effective in systemic infections. And historically, it is written in the ancient writings that more is not better when it comes to black seed oil. So when I say on the bottle, take one to four gel caps a day, this is the traditional dose. And it doesn't necessarily help to take a larger dose. So you can attain what you need and still be economical in your use of black seed oil. And this is a problem in supplements. People say, well, this is a good antibiotic, but you have to drink a cup of it a day. That's hard to do. Nobody does that, let's be honest. But a teaspoon or two a day of black seed oil or a few gel caps a day, you're there. Now, I don't have a problem if you're very sick. Let's say you come down with the flu and you want to have two or three gel caps three or four times a day for a day or two to get you started. Get your blood level up and then go down to your normal dose. That's fine. In fact, that's a pretty good idea. It's a good idea to do. But you don't need high doses endlessly to be effective with black seed oil. That's remarkable, isn't it, Cindy? You, you've learned a lot about these natural agents. And to be able to achieve a therapeutic level with modest doses, that's a very good thing. Equal to a cephalosporin, this is like Keflex, something like that. You know, a cephalosporin for the treatment of staph. Equal to that. Proven synergy with pharmaceutical antimicrobials. So maybe you need to take an augmentin. Maybe you feel it's necessary. Take your black seed with it. Make the penicillin, the cephalosporin, uh, the Bactrim, whatever it is you're taking. Make it more effective with the black seed oil. Excellent complement to oil of oregano, olive leaf, and mangosteen. You can also add other natural agents to complement black seed oil when you need strong antibacterial action. And oil of oregano is one of the best. Olive leaf is also excellent. And mangosteen, especially for intestinal infections. So combining those is fine. In fact, it makes it more powerful in my opinion. I don't have a study for that, but it just makes sense to me that it would. Now, let's do our antioxidant properties before we go to our break. It is a powerful antioxidant. <clears throat> Not only the molecules in 
the compounds of, uh, of black seed oil, but black seed oil affects our native antioxidant pathways. It tools up the DNA-directed production of internal enzymes that act as our major antioxidant mechanisms. The malonaldehyde, general marker of oxidative stress, it lowers that. That can go high with homocysteine problems or B12 deficiency. It improves glutathione, superoxide dismutase, and at least three other native antioxidant pathways. Black seed oil, a powerful antioxidant. We'll be back with more in just a minute. May Savings Time is here again with our annual cancer-free celebration. Cindy and I would like to thank you for your continued support of our efforts here at Your Health Television and at BioInnovations. We understand you must be very careful with your budget, so we're offering you the best prices of the year on many of your favorite supplements for the entire month of May. And shipping is free on all orders over $50 in the continental U.S. Perhaps you've heard about many of these supplements and wondered if they'd help you. Now's a great time to give them a try. Dr. Becker's Bionutrients and Noni Natural Skin Care are up to 50% off. Aloha Noni and Acai are still half priced by the case. And many other products you've grown to trust are up to 30% off. May is a great time to stock up on your favorites. Order online at bioinnovations.net or call 888-442-2128 and let us assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. I'm Cindy Becker for Your Health at a Glance. Each year, more than 76 million Americans contract food poisoning. Most cases are caused by tainted fruits and vegetables, especially contaminated leafy lettuce. But poultry causes the most food poisoning related deaths. To prevent food poisoning, follow these simple rules. Thoroughly wash all fruits and vegetables. When preparing any kind of meat, wash your hands, utensils, and work area before preparing any other food. Cook thoroughly chicken and ground meats. Store leftovers in the refrigerator immediately. Look for expiration dates when you shop. If you use reusable grocery totes, wash them periodically. And finally, use spices such as garlic and oregano to inhibit the growth of bacteria that cause food poisoning. Food safety lowers your risk significantly of getting sick. For your health at a glance, I'm Cindy Becker. Have you heard about the health-promoting power of medicinal mushrooms? These remarkable mushrooms include maitake, shiitake, reishi, and ABM. The medicinal mushrooms contain beta-glucans, compounds that promote healthy immune function while helping to coordinate multiple body systems. Bioinnovations brings you Dr. Becker's Bionutrients Mushroom Complex with maitake, shiitake, reishi, and ABM in one convenient product. Our mushroom complex features the safest and most powerful medicinal mushrooms available, providing natural support for a variety of health conditions. Bioinnovations is the affordable source that you can trust for all your vitamin and supplement needs. So give us a call at 888-442-2128. That's 888-442-2128. Or order online at bioinnovations.net. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. Welcome back, everyone. It is special savings celebration time at Bio Innovations. Great prices, best prices of the season, and don't forget, free shipping on your orders over $50. Of course, that's the mainland USA, but you don't want to miss this one. And you can take advantage of that and get your black seed oil, both the liquid and the cap, both at the same time. Why not? Two for one punch. So, Richard, this yes. one is, and like we were saying earlier, you can take it internally, topically, right. and the liquid you can take internally. It's just amazing. This is something that I firmly believe every health-minded family should have the gel cap and the liquid That's right. in their refrigerator or their medicine cap, wherever you like right. to keep your supplements, so it's handy. Right, and before we get going, just a quick little side note. Like we were saying, children, pets, us, oh, adults, absolutely. I use it on my horse's hooves when they have an really? issue. We use it in our dog's ears. We use it, oh, our whole yeah. family. <clears throat> use it in my ears. Right. <laughs> okay, so we had the anti 
um, microbial. Now let's talk about anti-inflammatory. Yes, anti-inflammatory. You know, so many of our chronic diseases and acute diseases feature inflammation. And it gives us pain and swelling and just plain misery. And if inflammation is allowed to run rampant over time, it can lead to heart disease, it can lead to cancer, Alzheimer's disease, uh, things nobody wants. So calming inflammation without the side effects of drugs. You know, the anti-inflammatories, they had hoped that it would help to prevent heart disease, help to prevent Alzheimer's, all these various conditions associated with inflammation. Not so. It doesn't. The side effects cause too much trouble. Yeah, you may lower the risk of Alzheimer's disease, but the anti-inflammatory gives you a heart attack, and you won't be around to appreciate it. See, that's the problem with the drugs. Now, medicines have their place. I'm not anti-medicine, but why should we ignore a whole world of therapeutically powerful agents just to take a drug? That makes no sense to me, and I've studied medicines all my life, all my adult life. There's a place for them, but there's also a place for these natural agents. Now, the anti-inflammatory action of black seed oil, it calms inflammation by at least 12 different mechanisms. If I were to take an ibuprofen, it would calm inflammation by one mechanism, but this drug ibuprofen and other anti-inflammatories inhibits other enzymes that do normal functions for us, like provide protection to our stomach lining provide normal control of our cardiovascular system. And when we take the drug, it's so powerful, not only does it calm the inflammation, maybe it relieves the headache, but it does damage to other areas. We're trying to avoid that. Black seed oil has no damage. 12 gentle mechanisms, a little here, a little there, that adds up, the synergy adds up to a big effect, but without overstimulating enzymes or without over inhibiting enzymes. This is the secret to natural agents, lack of side effects. 12 different mechanisms. It improves eosinophil function. Eosinophils are related to, to allergy and a few other things. Its antioxidant properties helps to calm inflammation. It normalizes cytokines, which are how our bodies send information through lipooxygenase to initiate inflammation. I have a problem, let's say I have staph growing on my arm. That sends a message throughout the body to tool up inflammation, and there's a, there's a good reason for it, to help us fight infection, but the inflammation causes much of our misery. We can use black seed oil to not only fight the infection, but calm the inflammation, and you're feeling better faster. It affects neutrophils, which are our major antibacterial white blood cell count, and they can go nuts and cause you great misery. It's not always necessary. It also affects their, our INOS, which is the nitric oxide synthase. This is part of our cell signaling. It is a major uh, part of how our bodies communicate both with cell to cell cell to itself, cell to neighbor cells, and cell to distant cells. It's really quite a complex system, but black seed oil modulates, meaning it can ramp it up or calm it down. This is just an amazing thing to study this. The, the marvelous, I, I just don't understand, just a side thought, how somebody could believe all of this life science could happen by chance. Can you believe that? People actually believe this. There's no way. This is a divine creation. Uh, just something to think about. Something to think about. Anti-inflammatory actions of black seed oil. COX-1 and 2 enzymes like the non but without the side effects. Lowers markers of inflammation in autoimmune arthritis. Lowers inflammation in autoimmune thyroid disease. At least 12 different mechanisms to calm inflammation. Pain. Black seed oil and pain inhibits the transmission of pain signals up the spinal cord. Now, narcotics do this, but so does noni and black seed oil, but without narcotics. We can inhibit the pain transmission signals up the spinal cord without the narcotic, without dependency. It works so well, the black seed oil has been used traditionally to help people get off opium and other narcotics. It helps with narcotic withdrawal. It's that effective. Isn't that amazing? This is stuff we need to know. 
We're in the middle of what, they, what the media calls a narcotic epidemic. And we need to have better ways to calm our pain without dependency inducing narcotics. Pay attention, folks. This is how we do it. This is how it's done in the natural world. Black seed oil also lowers cholesterol levels, LDL cholesterol, triglyceride, while it raises HDL, particularly the black seed powder raises HDL, but some research says that the oil does it as well. Proven lipid lowering in postmenopausal women, also proven lipid lowering in diabetes. Not only does it lower the cholesterol in diabetes, it helps to control the measures of glucose control in diabetes. And we'll talk about that when we return from these important messages. Savings Time is here again with our annual cancer-free celebration. Cindy and I would like to thank you for your continued support of our efforts here at Your Health Television and at Bio Innovations. We understand you must be very careful with your budget, so we're offering you the best prices of the year on many of your favorite supplements for the entire month of May. And shipping is free on all orders over $50 in the continental U.S. Perhaps you've heard about many of these supplements and wondered if they'd help you. Now's a great time to give them a try. Dr. Becker's Bionutrients and Noni Natural Skin Care are up to 50% off. Aloha Noni and Acai are still half priced by the case. And many other products you've grown to trust are up to 30% off. May is a great time to stock up on your favorites. Order online at bioinnovations.net or call 888-442-2128 and let us assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. is our hope for you today. I'm Cindy Becker. Christian counselor Dr. Henry Brandt wrote, to dwell above with the saints we love, that will be grace and glory. But to live below with the saints we know, well, that's another story. Throughout our lives, we encounter difficult people. These souls challenge the best of us. But the Apostle Paul suggested that we maintain our grace in spite of the actions of others. Paul wrote, if it is possible, as far as it depends on you, live at peace with everyone. Paul acknowledged it may not be possible in all cases, but we should still do our best. Try to look at difficult people through Christ's eyes. Remember his sacrifice was for everyone, even those saints we know who challenge us. I'm Cindy Becker. This is our hope for you today. Can you lower your risk of disease? The answer is yes. One way is by including fruit in your diet. Fruit contains valuable nutrients that can reduce the risk of heart disease, stroke, and even some cancers. We've searched the world and found four fruits we believe are among the best. Noni from Polynesia, acai from the Amazon, and two new ones, goji and mangosteen. These four juices each have amazing properties that make them great additions to your nutritional plan. If you're a diabetic or have chronic pain, these juices will help you feel better and have more energy. Plus, they help with digestion. Now you can experience the health-promoting benefits of all four in one convenient package we call the Fruits of the World 4-Pack. And remember, it's 50% off by the case. Order online at bioinnovations.net or call 888-442-2128 and let us assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. That number is 888-442-2128. We're back, everyone. Just a quick reminder, it is special savings celebration at Bio Innovations. Great prices, best prices of the season, and free shipping on your orders over $50 in the mainland USA. Great time to get your black seed oil. So, Richard, yes. black seed oil and the diabetic, could yes. it be a connection there? Something yes, it could it do for the diabetic? Yes, it has been used to help the diabetic manage their blood glucose for many, many, many centuries. Lowers glucose levels, cholesterol, triglyceride, the long-term hemoglobin, uh, excuse me, long-term glycosylated hemoglobin, that's your long-term glucose levels, it is lowered, lowers insulin resistance, and it helps to keep insulin levels low, which are all good things in the management of diabetes. Reduces appetite and weight gain. This is done in double-blind 
placebo-controlled human trials. Most diabetics need to lose a little weight, not all diabetics, but if we can help control our appetite, drop a little weight, bring our sugars down, maybe you don't need two or three medicines. Maybe one would be enough. Or maybe exercise, healthy diet, black seed oil, and, um, and um, olive leaf extract, some of our other well-known probiotics for uh, diabetes control is all you need. Isn't it better to do it without medicines if we can do it effectively? I think it is. Fewer side effects, cheaper. And the scientists have figured out all the different ways that black seed oil manages the diabetic. It's really quite impressive. Cardiovascular protection. Black seed oil lowers blood pressure, seven systolic, about, and five diastolic points. That's the average in a, in a large study of people. It's some 300 people taking black seed oil for hypertension. It lowers vascular inflammation, inhibits platelet stickiness and blood clots, decreases uh, glucose and the cardiovascular disease profile in diabetics, we talked about that. Modulates endothelial function, protects the heart, reperfusion injury. Let's go on down to cancer. There's so much, I, there's no way I can get through all this, <laughs> but I'm gonna try to get as much as I can for you. Black seed oil fights cancer by at least eight Eighteen different mechanisms. Can you believe that? Eighteen different mechanisms? Enzyme activation, glutathione, antioxidants, we can go on and on on, on the mechanisms studied in a variety of cancers. Carcinoma, cancers of the kidney, cancer of the stomach, ovary, cervix, lung, pancreas, head, neck. This is a foundational medicine in the Middle East. They study it a lot because they use it a lot. They want to know how to use it most effectively. Intestinal tract infections, sarcomas, prostate cancers, osteosarcomas, lymphomas, leukemia, melanoma, all helpful, all helpful. Chemical constituents have been uh, uh, thymoquin and alpha hedrin, at least 10 other metabolites are known to have anti-cancer effects. Modulates nine of the 10 hallmark propagators of cancer. Add this with a little curcumin. Boy, now you're doing something because it's a very powerful anti-cancer agent. The traditional way to use black seed oil in the treatments of cancers to support the cancer patient is black seed oil with raw honey. And if you think about this, raw honey would give some uh, glucose calories and critical nutrients and immune modulating agents. And the black seed oil does these 18 different mechanisms plus its nutrient value. And you know, in cancer, we don't, don't always want to eat. Sometimes, oh, you can go days without food. You, you actually feel better sometimes without food. But a little black seed oil, a little raw honey could help keep you going, plus you get the medicinal benefits. And I think that's just brilliant. You know, the ancients knew what they were doing. They did. They had the same brain we have, and they had to use the tools available to them. So let's take advantage of that. Stomach protection, we talked about the ulcer protection. Liver and kidney protection. I just had a call from a gentleman who's in renal dialysis, and he's struggled with asthma his whole life. And I sent him a bottle of black seed oil, he called back and said, with my first dose, I could breathe better. From black seed oil, renal dialysis, chronic kidney disease, and asthma. Can you believe that? And the studies show it helps to protect the kidneys, liver and kidney protection. You know, as we go through all this, we're seeing black seed oil is truly a supplement for all health conditions. It's just remarkable. Brain protective. Black seed oil has a unique ability to calm, to sedate, and to awaken or stimulate at the same time, or as you need it. I need to fall asleep, I'm anxious, I'm stressed, calm me down, my elbow hurts, everywhere I turn, I ache, I can't fall asleep. Black seed oil, a little noni, you're gonna fall asleep. It's gonna help you, and you'll wake up not groggy from a drug. See, there are so many advantages to thinking naturally. It's a natural antidepressant. Do you know anyone who can't get their seizures under control? Try black seed oil, curcumin, and vitamin D. It's been studied. The vitamin D is my addition to that combination. The ancients used black seed oil and curcumin together with good effect to help to control chronic, um, uncontrollable seizures. Respiratory disorders, 
you know, emphysema, asthma, and this type of thing, black seed oil improves pulmonary function testing results. If you have those conditions, you know, when you breathe into the tube, your measures will come back better if you take black seed oil. Immune protective, at least eight different mechanisms to either build up the immune system or calm it down depending on your need. Wound healing, particularly for the diabetic. Apply it right to the wound. Diabetic ulcers, right to the diabetic ulcer. Take a little internally. Acts as a natural antibiotic. It stimulates wound closure. Helps you control the glucose levels for the diabetic. It helps to improve wounds. Now, toxicity. Everyone's always concerned about, oh, they're dangerous. They enter, these herbs haven't been, not, this is just, it's the big lie that everybody wants to believe. It's not so. Black seed oil has a wide margin of safety, therapeutic at high doses and at low doses. It's safe at all of these doses. It takes a lot of black seed oil to do any significant damage. No liver changes, no bone marrow changes, no damage to the DNA, no tumor formation, no abnormal formations or birth defects in lab, ab, uh, lab animals. However, the strong physiologic uh, effects of black seed oil suggest if you take high doses for a long period of time, it could have side effects. However, there are none in the literature. People have been taking this for centuries without problems. Make sense? All right, when we return, let's talk about how do we take black seed oil and who would benefit the most from this remarkable herb. We'll be back. May Savings Time is here again with our annual cancer-free celebration. Cindy and I would like to thank you for your continued support of our efforts here at Your Health Television and at BioInnovations. We understand you must be very careful with your budget, so we're offering you the best prices of the year on many of your favorite supplements for the entire month of May. And shipping is free on all orders over $50 in the continental U.S. Perhaps you've heard about many of these supplements and wondered if they'd help you. Now's a great time to give them a try. Dr. Becker's Bionutrients and Noni Natural Skin Care are up to 50% off. Aloha Noni and Acai are still half priced by the case. And many other products you've grown to trust are up to 30% off. May is a great time to stock up on your favorites. Order online at bioinnovations.net or call 888-442-2128 and let us assist you in making the right choices for better health. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. I'm Dr. Richard Becker for Your Health at a Glance. Do you have a family history of a certain disease? Scientists are discovering that our genetic code plays a smaller role than previously believed. Only about 20% of disease is tied to our innate genetic code. So what determines the other 80%? The answer may lie in the emerging field of epigenetics. What is it? Epigenetics is a group of changing factors responsible for both how our genes are read and how they are then applied throughout the rest of the body. And this may explain why identical twins with identical genes can have different health problems. Researchers believe two of the main factors in epigenetics are nutrition and environmental exposure to toxins. So eat a healthy diet, reduce toxin exposure, and you may improve your own epigenetics. For your health at a glance, I'm Dr. Richard Becker. Every day, about 200 million Americans do not get enough of a key essential mineral. That mineral is magnesium. The typical American diet does not supply enough. And magnesium is so important. It protects bones and helps more than 300 different enzymes in the human body perform efficiently. That's why BioNovations offers chelated magnesium capsules for oral use and topical magnesium gel to be applied to the skin. That's two forms of magnesium to meet your daily needs. Scientific evidence points to chelation as the best method of vitamin and mineral formulation. Order online at bioinnovations.net or call 888-442-2128 and let us assist you in making the right choices for better health. Because chances are you are one of the 200 million Americans who need more magnesium every day. Again, that number is 888-442-2128. Call today. Ask about the AutoShip program for additional savings. Your Health is brought to you by BioInnovations, trusted products for your health and well-being. 
We're back, everyone. Just a quick reminder, it is special savings time at BioInnovations. Don't miss it. Make sure you get your black seed oil. And remember, free shipping on your orders over $50. Of course, that's the mainland USA. So, Richard, who would benefit or who should consider supplementing with yes. black seed oil? Just about anyone from infancy all the way up to old age. There, I even saw a study of staph pustules in neonates. You know, these are newborns and well tolerated. It worked better than mupericin, which is a common topical uh, treatment for staph. Who should take it? Just about anybody. Cancer patients of all types. It helps to improve cancer outcomes and helps to lessen the side effects of cancer treatment. Black seed oil, raw honey, great combination. Raw honey should never be given to babies under one year of age, so keep that in mind. Cardiovascular disease of all types, high blood pressure, angina, heart attack, stroke, peripheral vascular disease, diabetes, glucose control, both type one and type two. But when you start black seed oil or any natural agent, be sure and keep track of your glucose levels. You may need less medicine. You may need less medicine. It works that well. It does make a difference. Infectious disease of any type, whether it's bacterial, virus, fungal, parasitic, pneumonias, herpes, colds, UTI, you name it, can be helpful for a lot of things. Autoimmune disease, particularly thyroid disease. That along with a bee um, royal jelly, very helpful in lowering antibodies to the thyroid gland. Keep that in mind, folks. Respiratory conditions, asthma, COPD, pneumonias, improves pulmonary function levels, uh, testing results. Pain from virtually any cause, just pain. Chronic, acute, you name it, painful conditions. Rub it on the painful area, take it internally. Immune suppression from any cause. Many cancer patients are left with immune suppression. Use these agents to help build up that immune system. Fatigue, chronic fatigue syndrome, fibromyalgia, any, anything that causes you fatigue. Antioxidant for youthful aging and health maintenance, skin conditions of a wide type, and as Cleopatra taught us, as a beauty aid. <laughs> it's great, put a little on the face and whatnot uh, before bedtime, ladies, makes a big difference. Uh, we provide black seed oil in gel caps. They're 500 milligrams each. And the typical dose is from one daily to two twice a day. So from one to four. And as we learned, it doesn't necessarily help to take larger doses. But there's nothing wrong with taking a couple days to load your body with a little higher dose and then follow the usual dose. It's fine. It'll save you money and be just as effective. That's what the studies are showing. We also have the oil, one quarter to one half teaspoon, up to two times a day. Complements noni, oil of oregano, olive leaf, curcumin, L-lysine for infectious condition. Black seed oil has naturally occurring coumarins, which may amplify the effect of warfarin for bleeding control. However, I saw no case reports of problems with bleeding with black seed oil. Thank you for your kind attention. We'll see you tomorrow, folks. Hey, come on in. 843-323-4228. Hey, come on in. I'm Grady Hendricks, the General Manager for WLCN-TV in Charleston, South Carolina. And I invite you to advertise your Christian-owned business, ministry, or church on your Christian television station. We can advertise your business on your Christian television network three times a day, seven days a week, for $300 a month. It's an incredible opportunity. 843-323-4228.